It's August 24th and the sip is finally actually dry for the first time this summer. It's been a very dry summer. Uh, I've been filling it up here. We'll show you the last part of that process. This is our uh, plant watering can and you'll see that this one doesn't have a, uh, a, a little thing with holes on the end to slow down the water flow. And this is the one we use to load up the sip. It's the first time actually using this. You see here's the uh, input tube. And when I fill this up, the first 7 liters went in just fine. We calculated, if you recall, that this takes 23.19 liters. And the, uh, the first 7 liters goes in easy. The second 7 liters you kind of have to watch out that you don't overfill because it goes down slow because now it's in the wicking agent. And here we go with our last 7 liters. I could probably do a little bit more but because it goes to the wicking agent I think I'll just leave it at uh, 21 liters and we'll see how it does. We can measure that with our uh, with our uh, what's that thing called? Hydrometer. Hydrometer. Yep. Okay here goes. This might look funny because I'm doing my own camera work. On the first tube, it licks up this water just as quick as I can pour it. But on this one, we're going to have to wait a little while for it to uh, slowly drink it down. And you see it is going down. It's not a horribly long process or anything, but it's getting kind of full. I think we should have a water top down too. Yeah, I'll bet. Okie doke. Pour in a little more. This is a two liter Diet Coke bottle. So that gives you an idea how much water is in there at once. This thing's been working gangbusters all summer. This is the first time we've had to water it. But it's been a fairly long dry spell. We've got fire warnings everywhere. Okay, that all got drank down. I guess it takes so long to drink this down because it only takes sips. Did you wait to say that till I got out here? Well, no, but 